you have a question, raise your hand. Right here in the front, on the left hand side. Is someone with a, with a hat? <coughs> yes. Right there. Hi, congratulations. Thank you. What do you think, um, well, why do you think the, um, the audience is, uh, they're so, they're, they're obsessed with true crime shows? <laughs> you know what, I don't know because I'm one of those people. I don't know, there's just something about trying to unpack the how and the why. But um, I'm very, very grateful that they acknowledge my performance um, in Dahmer. Uh, we're going to take a question from our virtual press room. Let's go to Yvonne Abedi of Empower Atlanta Magazine. Go ahead, Yvonne. Hi, and congratulations. Um, you've been in this industry for a long time, and you've won a lot of awards. During that time, how was winning an Emmy for this role specifically, which I know is very demanding, different? Well, it's very different because I was known for a long time in this town as a comedic actress only. And I really wanted to be able to prove to my peers and my industry that I am not a one trick pony. I got some of the tricks up these beautiful sleeves. And I think tonight solidified that. I feel fully seen as an artist tonight. And I'm very grateful for that. And we'll take uh, one more question. Actually, we have a question in the back. Back row, and then we'll take one more after this. Congratulations. Thank you. During your acceptance speech, you thanked yourself and gave yourself the recognition you deserve, which is something women, especially black women, can struggle to do. Why was it important for you to take that moment? Well, because, you know, I'm the only one who knows what it costs me. I'm the only one who knows how many nights I cried because I couldn't be seen for a certain type of role. I'm the one who knows what it's like to go through divorce on camera and still have to pull up and show out and you still got to go home and you have children and a whole life. And so I'm proud of myself. I'm proud that I did something that people said I could not do because I believed in me. And sometimes people don't believe in themselves and I hope my speech was a delicious invitation for people to do just that. <laughs> believe in yourself and congratulate yourself. Sometimes you got to encourage what? Yourself. And that's why it's not called mama esteem, them esteem, us esteem. It's called self esteem, because don't nobody got to believe it but you. Hey. One more question from our virtual press room, if you don't mind. Uh, we'll go to Rebecca Lewis of Hello Magazine. Go ahead, Rebecca. Hey, Rebecca. Hi, DC. Congratulations on the win. Um, I wanted to ask, you just mentioned about being, wanting to be seen as a dramatic actress, and I wanted to say that you have been doing some great work in The Rookie and The Rookie Feds, which very frustrating when the ABC has cancelled. I wonder if we'll be able to see Simone again back on The Rookie, and you can just talk a bit about that, that experience as an actress. It was one of my favorite jobs because it was one of my favorite casts I've ever worked with. But no, I don't think there are plans for that that I know of, you know. Uh, I'm living in the in the word onward, so that's where I'm at right now. Ha! I don't go back. No, just kidding. <laughs> Is that it? I think so. Thank, Thank you, you guys.